Now the smallest increment in a currency pair is one pip. I'm going to talk on the course that I do about uh, mini lots and micro lots and normal lot sizes but I, I want to tell you in the video how you can make things a lot easier. You can open up a spread betting account with as little as four to five hundred pounds and every pip movement in a spread betting account is one point. And what we do is we bet so much per point. So if we bet five pounds per point, every pip or small movement that that currency pair did, you would make five pounds if you bet five pounds a point. So what we're looking for on a currency pair is intraday, that's during the day, we're trying to look for moves that might last 40 pips or 40 points. And if you bet five pounds a point, then you would make 200 pounds tax free. If you did that five days in a week, then you'd make a thousand pound that week, which is 4,000 a month. So trading Forex is, is nice for people that want to earn a second income and you can trade it outside your normal work hours. Now one of the things I'm going to do is I'm going to teach you how to trade other things on the market that move say 80 points, 120 points, 160 points and maybe 200 points in a day. So later on in my courses I talk about how to find and make 40 points but I'm going to show you how to try and make up to 200 points a day. So imagine you might be making 40 points on Forex and doing very nicely but there are other strategies and other tactics that you can make 200 points. So imagine if you did that in a day and you were betting five pound a point then you would make a thousand pound for the day. So trading Forex is very profitable if you understand the secrets and you understand exactly what to do. If you wanted to do it in a spread betting account, you'd only have to start with four to five hundred pounds. And you can imagine 200 points in a day, even if you traded one pound a point, would be 200 pounds. So this is a really good way of earning a second income.